Hey guys, it's uh, Brutal Links again, and I just uploaded um, a new episode, which was, you know, what price did you pay for being gay, and, you know, homophobe gets his ass kicked. But um, no sooner than I, you know, shared the video out, you know, to my Facebook and Twitter and everything else, no sooner than that is done... I get a text message. Um, text messages from a really good friend of mine out in Seattle. Um, yeah, I knew him when he was over here in New York. We worked together for a bit, and you know we became really good friends. And you know, he used to do drag, which was amazing. And um, the text message I got was that he had just been bashed. He had just been bashed, and. Um, you know, the cops are doing what cops do and everything else. He's in the hospital. And uh, apparently he was just out with some friends. And um, they were coming out of a bar or a club, I guess, in which it was a straight establishment, but they were not. But it's Seattle, right? And as they were coming out and walking, I don't know where, someone came up, sucker punched him. And then proceeded to beat him up. Um, according to his friend, the one who was texting me, they kept trying to tell him to, you know, stay down and not get back up. But he just kept getting back up. Um, he's in the ICU. And I just want him to know a few things. So we'll consider this a public service announcement for all. Thing number one, the people who you were with, if they saw you get sucker punched and someone starts beating up on you and they're telling you to A, not get up, and B, they're not doing anything to help you, those are not your friends. They're not. Did any of them call a cop during? Did anyone try to pull these people off of you? Did anyone... People who just stood by and watched without doing anything, those aren't your friends. You need to get new friends. You, you, you do. New friends or a stun gun or something. But the PSA is... Don't ever stay down when someone knocks you down. And this goes in all facets. This is emotionally, this is physically, this is financially, this is politically. This is in all facets of your life. If they want to take you down and you know you're not going to win, make them work for it. Don't just let it happen. Make them work for it. You made them work for it. Unfortunately, it was not your day to win, but you still won. And you won because you didn't stay down. You got back up. How many people have the strength, the bravery, the balls, the heart, or anything else like that to get back up. If anything, out of your tragic incident, something positive can come out of this. And the positive thing that can come out of this is that you kept getting back up. Do not ever let anyone knock you down. And this goes for all of you. Do not let anyone knock you down and then you stay there. No. They knock you down. You get right back up. You get right back up and you let them know that you are not an easy target. You are not going to take crap laying down. You didn't win, but you made them fight for it. You made them have to work for it. It was not the easy kill that they thought it was going to be. And you're in my thoughts, man. You're in my thoughts. So just let that be for everyone. Don't let anyone ever knock you down. And then you stay there. No, we all trip and fall sometimes, but how many of us have the balls or the bravery to get back up? Don't take it lying down. Get back up.